Hi, I'm Andrea. Welcome to my channel. I need more lives. Hi, this is an update on my weight loss. It's been about two months since I finished a 40-day water fast. Um, I've been on raw for, I guess, two months. And my weight right now is 239.5. That is the least I have weighed in at least 16 years. So, um, my some of my 250 pound clothes are a little too big on me right now, so that's good. Um, I have decided to go on a second water fast, which will probably be until my birthday. Um, it might be 30 days, it might be 21 days, it might be 30 days, it might be 40 days. Um, excuse my voice is going out, I'm about to go to sleep, I'm really tired. It's like uh, 1 a.m. here. Um, so I'm going to stand up, do a, um, like a before my second fast shot, and uh, this is my starting point, 239.5, so I'm going to stand up now. Okay, so um, that is my, I guess, two-month update after my water fast. I did not gain weight. I actually lost weight after water fast. Um, the reason why I'm not going to be going on 80-10-10 is because for my body, for some reason, I don't know if it's because I have dumping syndrome or not, I cannot eat sugar in really any form. I can eat moderate amounts of fruit, but as soon as I start to eat fruit, I seriously gain weight, so I can't do it, and I won't be ever on that diet. Um, raw diet, I don't believe is sustainable for me, personally, 100% raw, but I do believe that 80% raw is a good place for me. Um, I, I do crave fish while I'm on raw, and I don't like fish. So I believe that I'm really missing something with the raw diet if I'm craving foods that I don't even like. Um, I, I do like meat. I do like to eat meat. Um, I went on Atkins several, like 10 years ago or something, and I lost 94 pounds. I got down to 244, and that's my smallest I've been for uh, 16 or so years. So um, I did gain all the weight back because I started to eat carbs again, and specifically I started to eat grain. What I will eliminate completely from my diet, except maybe on special occasions, but from my regular diet, I will not eat grains or any type of sugar. Um, processed sugar. I will eat occasional fruit, but um, any processed sugar I do not eat. I have been taking stevia to sweeten my drinks and things um, for five or six years now. Uh, stevia has really done well for me, and I get the kind, the cow brand, K-A-L, and it doesn't have an aftertaste for me at least. I like it. Um, and a big $25 bottle lasts me for over a year, so it's well worth it, and it's 
actually cheaper than sugar because a lot of people buy sugar in huge quantities so it's uh, more portable than sugar you can put it in your purse and you know take it around with you and sweeten your drinks with it and restaurants and things um, well uh, let's just see how long I go on this fast um, but this is what I want to do uh, I want to do another fast even though I know it's going to take a lot out of me and make me tired and I am going to school um, online so I do have commitments you know and I do have a husband I do have a kid to take care of but this is going to enable me to stay around a lot longer and um, I feel really great now that I've lost uh, a lot of weight so far I don't even know how much of weight I've lost but uh, the beginning of my 40 day water fast I weighed 277 and now I weigh 239 so in just a few months and it's really hard to get used to a different body really I mean every day something is getting smaller something is changing I'm feeling bones it actually hurts uh, when people touch my ribs and people like hug me it hurts because I have not felt those bones for uh, 20 years probably and well you know I'm, th I'm 33 so that's pretty pathetic but uh, yeah um, I have the opportunity to go on this fast and actually get down to a normal weight and be like a normal sized person and I've I've not had that chance to do that I've not felt that I've been able to do that even working out every single day a strenuous workout coming home completely soaking wet from the gym or from walking or whatever I'm doing for hours at a time every day and not losing the weight you know like a normal person should be because when I exercise hard I eat hard so this seems to me like the easiest the quickest and the easiest to maintain after I've gotten down you know gotten through the weight it's the easiest to maintain for me you know to eating raw food and and eating meat whenever I feel I need to eat it um, I, I just feel better I feel so much better now that I know like the secret for me to lose weight and to get down to a, a normal person's size like for the first time in my whole life um, so um, I'll probably update like once a week or so I'm probably gonna be extremely tired um, starting this tomorrow um, not today but I'm starting tomorrow and we'll see how long it goes and thank you people who have sent me emails and and supporting me it's really helped a lot so thank you